Okay, hello, this is my uh, daily blog, um, and it's the, been wet today for, for the first time, it's been absolutely chucking it down um, all day, you, you can see it's wet, and uh, I also decided to do my washing today conveniently on, on the wettest day so far, I made a makeshift clothesline here, hung it from the, uh, the, the grill, I thought someone might steal through and take my jeans or something, but... <laughs> Didn't happen. Probably paranoia, you know. Maybe, maybe not everywhere is like Manchester, but that said, no one's ever stolen my jeans in Manchester. So, um, yeah, here we go. Outside. So I thought I'd uh, come into the flat and just share, you know, the typical. Well, not typical. Okay, this is just this. This flat's been used for ten years. So it's Eleven volunteers. Years. Eleven years. Volunteers get here. This is the lounge. So it's got lots of stuff of people over the years. Um, in a booze, I think. Yeah. <laughs> We've got Kyle here. He's come up from Bosch. Birstonis. 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 From the library. So he spends all his week in the library and all his on all weekend partying. Um, partying always in Kalnas yep. or in, maybe in Vilnius sometimes. Although he knows the value of a banana. A good banana is important, you know. I have two in my bag already. Empty. Two bananas. <laughs> and, a, and, a, and a towel. A Welsh towel. A Welsh towel, yes. just in case you forget where you're from, or someone goes exactly. But you, yeah, on. like just then, Maurizio said, "Oh, is the Welsh passport different?" I thought so because you know Welsh people are always Welsh people are always saying we are different, we are different, we, we are, are not different British, we are not British. <laughs> so I thought you they also had a different passport, but nope. sorry for my ignorance again. <laughs> it, it, it's British. It's okay. It's so you are British. <laughs> Welsh. <laughs> Don't escape for your British. I kill you in my toothbrush. For your Briti <laughs> Britishity. I was trying to think of a pseudo ignorant comment based on your Italianism for a second, but I couldn't. So. <laughs> yeah. So Kyle, tell me why you're here anyway. Why aren't you stuck in your town where you're volunteering, chilling out? Why are you here? I'm, I go out to I hitchhike to the north of Lithuania to see an English friend of mine. And you're going with an English girl. Tina. And she volunteers for? Caritas, I yes. think. Yes. I She's think. I don't know. I think. Yeah. I don't listen this to this. This is where I'm from. Oh, Wait. Much, no, that's where I am next half week. Half of it. Half of it. That sentence came out wrong. Less than half. So anyway, yes. Back to the uh, flat tour. This is the living room. It's it's basically, I would probably compare it to student digs, except with slightly more 70s or 80s kind of... Uh, I think the digs are much more much more quality in a, a dig than this. Okay, yeah. This, this is because it's quite basic. This is below digs. This is built in 1986. Find me student digs that have Soviet plug sockets though, that's what I say. Because <laughs> we have Soviet plug sockets and nothing works in them. <laughs> so, and we have an old DVD player but no TV. It's interesting. Exactly, um, <laughs> it's a <bit> flat. <laughs> so... Out from the living room into the kitchen, we've got Mr. Maurizio. Who likes I'm to cooking. Cook. The chef who likes to cook from scratch. Come, come to check the Italian cooking. Pa, 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 <laughs> Have you actually made this from scratch? Scratch? Yeah. From the beginning. No, no, I'm not so. I didn't think you did. I'm not so acrobatic cooker, but. Yeah, he made it from scratch. She was you. Oh really? What? He cut yeah, all, yeah, all yeah. the vegetables, the aubergine. It's a pasta con verdure. Pasta <laughs> vegetariana. It means uh, no, don't don't be scared, Mike. Don't be scared. Come on. I'll come closer. Uh, uh, eggplants and aubergine. No, paprika. Uh, paprika. Paprika. Yeah. Paprika. You say aubergine in England. No. I have to point out this is a, quite a mean feat considering the size of your spice rack, which is actually just a plastic bowl with <laughs> no more than two or three spices in mm, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the Italian cooking is very simple. We are not it's so very spicy. Basic, very basic. Yeah, yeah. Just pepper and rosemarine, basil. It's the Spanish that have the ingredients. The Spanish. Yeah. Uh, the, the, the Italians don't cook, don't want to. No, it be. smells nice though. I have to say, you know, it smell it's smell o vision was invented. This would be a good thing yeah, right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so, but not only is this a kitchen. Oh no, oh no, the tour continues because right over here is the editing suite. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. you That's see the the, the yeah. equipment, cables, here. power. Because this is the only place in the flat, um, in the kitchen, in the corner where we've got enough power sockets for me to edit on with a hard this drive. This is the desk where the, the magic. Begins. Will begin. Yeah, it's yet to happen. 
Uh, there's my hard drive, camera stuff, etc. It usually gets really messy and then I tidy it because I just throw stuff everywhere. And uh, yeah, so this is the kitchen. We've got a sink here with some uh, names next to some bikini clad women on the fridge, none of which I know either the photos, the women, or the names. Front. I can name them. What? <laughs> <laughs> Kyle can name the women, it's a good chance he can. So yeah, normal stuff in the fridge. Pimp, this is like um, cribs, you know? Check out my fridge, I got <laughs> What do you got in your fridge? I got some sardines. It's very, actually, it's very good fridge, very good, very good. It's food, yeah, and it's yeah. vodka, yeah, also, and it's a very good fridge. Students will have to take, take note, any students, you know? Going to university next year, maybe. Buy you yogurt and yeah. milk. You Necessities. You can survive off that for a few years. Yogurt, milk, beer. Um, margarine, margarine if you want yeah um mustard uh, oh actually and this is something interesting in and a bounty bar a bounty bar <laughs> everyone knows what this is but in lithuania everyone has this and everything um, no, or, or at least they seem to it's some kind of creamy garlic sauce like, and like a, like a garlic sauce yeah. garlic. we went to get a pizza last week and we just had, had a pizza which looked really nice and then went on to ruin it with copious amounts of tomato sauce. They with mayonnaise and garlic sauce. They do, they do, every time. I don't understand. But it's a very good fridge, better than my fridge. Yeah. My fridge is very empty, but yeah. this fridge yeah. is really good. I'd like to point out, there's some peppers here, um, cherries, uh, aubergine, not mine, but you know, most of the fruity stuff is mine. And also um, kefiras. That kefiras is mine. I thought it was milk, it's not milk at all. <laughs> so, but however, this is milk, and this is good milk. It's very good milk, very thick and creamy milk. It tastes like cows. A farm in Lithuania. And it's British got cream farm. in it. Me and uh, Kyle were, were reminiscing about how in England there used to be uh, this this job called uh, the milkman, and he used to drive to people's houses. I know, I know, it sounds a bit weird, you know, but in, in times, you know, before the 90s, he used to. Um, in fact, I used to have milk in school, but that's a whole I remember story. it, and, and I'm 20, I, I yeah. remember it. Drive around houses, and you could get orange juice, you could get milk from him in bottles, sweet, and it actually so, so sweet in my milk, milk tasted like milk. Yes. Now and it with, tastes with like... a spoon and the cream on top. Yeah. I Classic British life. Exactly. Yeah, it's like eating burger with mustard and some water mixed yeah. together. So and that's milk it. over here. Yeah. <laughs> Can't compare with that anyway in the milk. Nope. So I, here's, here's, here's something to throw back to the Tory government in England. Bring back real milk. <laughs> we want real milk. We want real milk. Yeah. So, give it to Maybe they can fund university fees with more with, with milk. I don't believe don't this could happen. I no. don't believe okay. that. No. So, carrying on. The rest of the tour. It's probably a bit dark now. Uh, normal sort of bathroom with all the necessities. It's very, the toilet. very Soviet. A very Soviet flat. It's very, look how old it is. I think maybe if this is a Soviet toilet, Soviet people were very thin because I can't fit myself on the toilet next to the uh, Mike, this is that older than you. Yeah. M maybe. No, it is older than you. I uh, bathroom. You know, usual bathroom. Could do with some improvement, but I'm yeah. not complaining because we have a shower. Um, it's more than most bad stuff. Which is more than, so yeah, exactly. Yeah. You know, not everyone has one of those. Um, not necessarily in Lithuania because I don't know, but in the world, let's say. This is a very... Problematic. I don't. Right? Yeah. Doesn't want to work. The electrics don't always work. There you go. And this. Can, oh. You see. Don't know what you're doing there. Click. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh well. Okay. Don't okay. 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 Uh, this is. Do I have to show my room? Yes. Okay. Right. It's a bit messy. Well, bear in mind it's not my room. I'm just a visitor this is, in this room. Uh, beginning of me to room. Then it became my room and Esther's room. Yep. The bed was so here, and everything has changed a yeah. bit. There's some wires, some spray, some junk, clothes on the floor, clean clothes. I did my washing today, as a, I said. A very common flat junk on bed. Yes. Very common yeah. bond, yes. Got a line there for my clothes, putting them up and down, Sorry, hanging them. It does remind me of camping, kind of like part camping, camping part student. This is Maurizio's Hello room. Again, guys. He's in every room. This, this guy. is my room, yes. I have to say, yours is more homely than mine. He's a very organised man. Look at his everything, documents, everything organised. Yeah. Yeah. A man of much respect with his yeah. organisation skills. Good man. I'm getting red. <laughs> I'm embarrassed. <laughs> Thank you, but... It's clean. It's, it's cleaner kind of, than it's mine. It's kind of messy today, actually, so you I'm be, sorry. Well, be crazy, yes. anyone who wants to criticise should know this. <laughs> da -da -da. <laughs> this is... Maurizio is a volunteer, doesn't get paid. You try and, you try and do up your house when you're not getting paid. That's all. That's all I've got to say. True story, guys. Yeah. yeah. And that's a, that's good respect. That's a, yeah. That's respect. Man, you do with what you you do the best with what you've got. What doesn't limit? Yeah. His, does his job well? That's what counts. Uh -huh. Does what he's here for very well. So we did uh, our best. Yes. Uh, I think that's it for today's 
magical tour of the flat. Um, if anyone's going to be going on EVS, like you and you are doing, mm -hmm. uh, at least if you ever come through Dineta or uh, you go to Lithuania, encounters, there's a chance you might live in somewhere like this. But this is just one example. This so flat is quite good flat compared to other volunteers. Yeah. Quite like the top market of flats. Really? Yes. I would say the girls' flat. There's another flat for Dineta, and I'd yeah. say the girls' flat is nicer. Dineta. Yeah, it's nicer, yeah. So That's your opinion. Yeah. They're quite the top market of our flat. Depends. So it's open to debate. Really, really yeah. low on quality. So this this video has been ten minutes and thirty seconds. I think that's far too long. So okay, yeah. finish it off. Cut. Good night. Bye. Bye.